Hello, I am Fury Cat, and welcome back to our RimWorld Let's Play, our Tribal Royalty Run. So when last we left off, we had quite a few injuries, mostly inflicted by people standing on our traps like idiots, or uh, beating each other up like idiots. Um, so we got a few in the hospital, um, but we are currently hosting Roni here. I say hosting, they're being kept prisoner. They'll be leaving in 4.1 days, but we are expecting two raids from our good old friends in the Nyomiakosia tribe, which uh, have yet to show up. Now, uh, we've been continuing work on our base here and there. We've expanded our brewery. We've added lots of new growing zones to help ke keep the, uh, the colony fed. Um, and, uh, yeah, we expanded this corridor so we could stagger the traps so that Hopefully our people can weave in and out of them while still potentially, you know, having people die. Oh, we've got another cougar there. Hmm. We look actually at the wildlife. Is there anything we want to be hunting? There are almost certainly going to be things we want to be hunting. So let's hunt all of these. Uh, can we hunt the muffalo? Sure. Let's go hunt the muffalo. Yes. Okay. That should do for now, I think. Um, now, what else were we going to be? We were thinking about doing a bit more construction. We need more blocks, so let's go ahead and speed time. We want to uh, get people awake. We need to get more slate blocks. Always more slate blocks. Uh, so we can find some more slate to haul in. There's a whole pile of it there. Uh, all of that. All of that. Sure, we'll get this lot as well. Why not? There you go. Plenty of slate. We need to keep going with the slate. It is our building material of choice these days. It's not the best building material, but it's what we've got to work with. Parish hard at work. It's good to see. We need somebody to uh, get on with our clothing uh, orders as well at some stage. Um, who is actually who are our tailors? Beaver is, but he's in the hospital. Parishes, but she's currently crafting blocks. Uh, Barracuda is kind of terrible at it, if we're being honest here, actually. Yeah, you're kind of dreadful. Dane's actually not bad at these things. So anyway, why don't we um, take you off? I don't think that's thing. Starvation? Why is Google starving? Well, go eat something, man. Not like we'd short on meals. Honestly. Uh, hey, you're fine. Fine meal to Rooney. Yeah, okay, that's fine. How is Rooney? Is Rooney still okay? Oh, Rooney needs treated. Uh, hey, Parish. Could you, um... Tend to... Tend to Rooney, please. Thank you. And then Tango came in and ate Roni's meal. I mean... Hey Barracuda, could you, um... I guess we can't feed Roni. Roni has been fed, apparently. You're ravenously hungry, but we can't feed a meal to Roni. Or do we need you to be our warden, which is cavernous? Deliver food to Roni. <laughs> Our dog's just coming in and eating the meal. <laughs> now, I think we're going to put another little room down here, which we're going to use for... Uh, we're going to transplant our uh, stone cutter's table in there, and we'll probably have our smelter in here as well. So, um, let's see. So we're probably going to want to... How are we going to do this? Um, does it need to be that big? I mean, how big is this table? It's what? It's three across? So, uh, let's see. Three across. And we want to have a table. We'll have the door, and then we'll have one two, three for another table, and then the wall. And we'll make it such that we could put 
repair them in there. There you go. And then we'll have our, our door, which can just be a standard steel door, which goes there. And we'll have a door through into... Uh, into here, sure. So that they can... Because the smelter may want access to this room. Okay, get that put in. Uh, I suppose we're going to want temperature controls in there, something we never really did previously. So uh, let's see. We're going to need to run power. Uh, where's our nearest power? It's over here. So if we run the power along here and down here, we need it for the smelter anyway. So that. Okay, that's used up a lot of our uh, available uh, slate for now. Um, what do we do? We do have sandstone and limestone kicking around. How much is it going to take to floor in here? That's 112. Yeah, we could floor it in limestone. Just to be different. Eclipse. It's fine. Uh, we're still... Oh, we're getting low on steel again. Right, let's get some more mining orders queued. Uh, right, now we need to do something about temperature in this room. So... Um, we'll pop a heater down here. And a cooler. There. Trumbo meat has rotted in storage. Oh, because it was left sitting on here, probably. I guess. Too unhappy new year. We need somebody to go work on that tailoring. Um, who's our best tailor? You're at seven. Parish is pretty good actually, so we'll get Parish to do that in the morning. Scorpion cooking away through the night. Good, good. these raids are going to show up. I mean, we have not seen any sign yet, and Rooney's not with us that much longer. 2.9 days. And we're supposed to get two of these raids. Hmm. Here comes Parish. What are you doing, Parish? You're... You're crafting something. What are you crafting, Parish? Making it in pea shells. Wasn't that nice? What I would really like you to do, Parish, once you've eaten, is um, do some tailoring, please. This is a hand tailoring belt bench. Oh, we'll need to replace that at some stage. Although we are, once again, super low on components. Well, not much we can do about that. Why are you not tailoring? Parish, I told you to tailor. Yeah, no, stop. Tailoring. Remember out of components. Great. Thank, thanks, Parish. I don't know. Do we need components for the cooler? We do. That's annoying. Upsetting, one might even say. Are you doing beaver? Alright, you're putting that in. Okay, that's fine. Good with that. Ugh, components. I'm sure I saw some down here. Yeah, I did. If we don't tunnel into <laughs> our ancient danger. We should really deal with that at some point. We're, I think we're close to being able to do that. Hey, she's made pants. Well done, Parish. Raccoon has a shoot frenzy. That's excellent. 
You're not armed though. Why are you not armed? Go grab a grab that SMG. Uh, inspired surgery from Nat. Do we? Is that? Does Nat do surgery? Um. No. In fact, currently Parish is our only healer. A bit concerning. Um. You may want to put Google. And have an ass also on to doing healing things. There. Are you just pregnant? Wow. And if I could grab Google. You come down here and prioritize mining that compacted machinery, please. Okay. Well, this is, room's ready, but we need the healer, the, the healer, the cooler and the um, heater to be put in. Uh, we should probably also make sure it's not in the grazing animal zone. Yeah, no, no, stop, no grazing in there. Let's just cleaning blood out here. I think we might need to have a look at our home area. Uh, yeah, see, it doesn't really like this. Is this can't be on fire? It's made of stone, so as long as you keep it clean and, and repaired, I don't really care about the area around it very much. Ditto for this stuff. Periodically, we just get weird things counting as home. Honestly, not too fussed about any of this area. Yeah, that's probably all fine. Trim all this back. It's a little bit tedious, but prevents people doing ridiculous things. Out. That's probably all okay. I don't see why this needs to be home area. I don't know that this needs to be home area. Uh, yeah, that's probably fine. That'll do. Uh, okay, we got a couple of components out of there. Uh, I don't see where they went though. Any more compacted machinery kicking around? I mean, I think we've done a fairly thorough job of harvesting all the compacted machinery. That's upsetting. We're going to need to go trading again then to get more. Components are never ending need for components. Ooh. Uranium right there. Yeah. I don't see any more compacted machinery. I think trading for components is gonna have to be on our agenda. That's upsetting, so it means I can't finish this. Most upsetting. I'll tell you what then, why don't we cancel that? Put the wall in uh, for just now. That way we can at least get this set up. Reinstall this. Right there. Any light, I suppose. So I guess I can go there. Oh, goody! A defoliator ship. Yay! More mechanoids. Hey Galga, what's your cooldown on your various things at this stage? Well, quite long. Hmm. It's upsetting. 
what we got. We got Scyther, 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 four Scythers. Oh, joy. They're going to charge at us and hack limbs off people. Great. Well, I think we'll just let that be for just now. It's not too near any of our crops, so I think we can afford to just kind of let it be for a little bit. Okay, so uh, orders. I'm going to remember to take roofs out this time. Check me out. Yeah, that roof can come out. Yeah, we've got all our overhead roofing to get to various places in the base. Got with that. Um. Yeah, okay, they're taking the roof out, and then we can deconstruct that. Bye. Uh, we're not going to be able to build a smelter just yet, but what we possibly can do, actually, is make uh, another stonecutter's table. Whoa, we're nearly at wood. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, hang on. Let's fix that. We can fix this. There are trees that we can cut. It's fine. Cut all these down. There we go. That'll take care of the, 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 the slight shortage we're having of wood. I hadn't realized that. It's just probably important because, you know, all our generators run on it. So, yeah, we're going we're gonna to want that. Okay. Good, good. Where is these raids? Like, Rooney here is only with us for another 1.4 days, and we have yet to see a raid. I mean, we've got the defoliator shit, but... <laughs> you know, it occurs to me, those guys... Oh, you scared Nat's running. He's like, oh my god! There's scythers and stuff. Yes, there are. He's just going to keep bouncing off them, isn't he? So I think we're going to have to deal with this. How do we do it? We're going to have to build an emplacement with some traps, I think. Uh, okay, look, Nat, could you just... I don't know what you're trying to do, but go do something not that. Well, you're trying to hunt, aren't you? You know what? What if I drafted you and moved you over here manually? And then I undrafted you. There you go. Now you can go hunt. Nope. Never mind. Back to base. Where are they coming from? Uh, they're prepared for wild attack. Looks like they are going to come in through our main defenses. Good, good. And that's the only group of them. Okay. Let's get this turned on. Turn our guns on. Uh, our animals. We will restrict our dogs and stuff to inside the base. Let me go turn the turrets on. Contact labor uh, Nah, after I draft you, I'm gonna need you to turn on that. Where are you going? We're turning inside the base. Okay, that's fine. That's on. Uh, let's have a look at this quest. Baron Tiberius. Docus of Imperium of the Moon needs people to help prepare a ceremony. He's asking me to lend one colonist servant for five days. He'll send a shuttle to pick up the colonist. Um, no. I need my colonists right now. So let's grab everyone. Draft. Everybody report to here. A mad donkey? No. Where is this mad donkey? It's coming up this way. <laughs> it's in for a shock. Everyone has reported to here. Scorpion, you're gonna hide out in the armory. Everyone else is armed. Uh, no, wait, you're not. Beaver, why are you unarmed? Uh, what do you do? You're a melee. Uh, go grab. 
grab that. Set up our colonists. Malier there, Malier there. Don't no, stick all the Malier there. Okay, guys, we're ready. This is the first, I think, really full scale test of our defenses. I'm confident. Think they'll, I think they will do what they're designed to do. Heck, we might, they might not even make it through the, you know, corridor of death. Not one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Yep, they didn't even make it through the corridor of death. Uns outstanding. Uh, let's have Scorpion. Could you quickly go rescue or capture that guy? Oh, that went well. Let's tag all their weapons for picking up. It badly hurts this guy. Very badly hurt. You good at anything? Fast Walker? Hmm. I need to get Parrish to come and save him in a moment. Oh, let's go ahead and speed time up. Grab Parrish. I'm going to draft you, Parrish, and head you down here. I may leave our turrets enabled for now, just in case. We are supposed to get two raids. Parrish. Uh, are you not ten? Why can I not have Parish tend to this man? She's drafted that be why, and she's not going to go and tend. Great, done. Well, I took care of that in a reasonably straightforward manner. Yeah, let's have a look at this guy. He's a fast walker. Good. He has bloodlust. He's more likely to start a social fight. But he never insults others and never judges people by their appearance. Okay. 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 What can he do? Um, he's good with animals and good at mining. He's good at melee. But honestly, it's another body to just do kind of cleaning and hauling might be kind of useful. And he's decent in a melee fight. So, well, let's, uh, let's break his resistance. That went well. We obviously need to replenish our traps and uh, we are getting kind of low on steel again, so we're mining. What you doing, Scorpion? You're visiting a grave. Whose grave are you visiting? You're visiting Beaver's grave. Oh. There's another egg sitting out in the open where it shouldn't be. Get that, de get that egg in where it's meant to be. These are all unfertilized. No one. All these unfertilized eggs. Where's the fertile ones? We want, we want more ducks. Dane hauling in dead bodies. Good, good. How much longer do we keep this for? 6.3 days, okay. Ugh, defoliator ship. I'm thinking we castle up. We maybe build an, a set of defences that come out from here. Line the area with traps. Then open fire at range. Force them to come to us under fire. And through, uh, we may get some EMP stuff in there as well. Grizzly Bear has self-tamed. We have a, a tame bear. 
Uh, well, okay. Sure, let's let's train the bear up. We'll turn it into an attack bear, I suppose. But I guess we better name the bear then as well. What will we, what will we call our bear? Uh, it's a girl bear. Um, call her Grace. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's get our animals back to unrestricted. Good and Grace. There you go. Welcome, welcome to the fold, Grace. I'm waiting on this other raid. We've only got Rooney for another seven hours. Hard at work reseeding our traps. Which did fantastic work for us there, it has to be said. Quite outstanding. Medical emergency. Why are you in risk of death? Do not appear to be in any risk of dying. You, 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 you. I don't know. I mean, okay, you've got extreme blood loss, but uh, give it time; that'll sort itself out. I think you're gonna live. Gosh, our our prison's at full capacity here. Ah, here comes that other raid. Okay. Grab all of you, because I don't know. I think you're all out and about in the map. Draft. Report to here. Where is the roid? Up there. We're gonna prepare for a while, then attack. Okay, we are. Uh, I suppose we should keep our animals back inside the base. Uh, right, let's get everybody lined up, and at least they'll be out of the rain when they're lined up. Uh, we'll check a Melier there, we'll check a Melier there. Coon can go there, we'll check a Melier there. Scorpion, you just hide in the armor in case I need you to rescue anyone. Here they come! Uh, so yeah, they're gonna come around this way. Except for this one, I don't know what that one's doing. Oh no, there they go, they're coming. How many of the traps did we arm? Um, yeah, most of them actually. So there's a good chance these guys aren't gonna make it through the traps either. Let's see. Shuttle is arriving. Right, we'll just finish dealing with this salt and then we'll back to Scorpion. I don't think we're going to need you. Could you carry Rooney to the shuttle, please? And yep, yeah, they're done. That's going to free us up another slot in our prison. Let's have a look what we got here. Chicken is downed. No, you're chicken. There you are. Uh, your left little toe's cut off. You've got asthma. You're incapable of social, creepy breathing, neurotic gelatin. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about Bagu here? You're so you're incapable of social. You're sanguine. Very upbeat all the time, but you're volatile. Okay. Guess they probably can't rank each other. Good at art, crafting, plants construct. You're not bad. How close to death are you? Three hours. Okay, um. Let's have a Dane you'll do. You go capture uh, Bagu, please. Oh, okay, let's have you move around here just now, because we'll, it'll be capturable in a moment once that's done. You guys are free to go. Uh, somebody turn off the power, please. That's been done. Uh, so, yeah, capture Bagu, please. Oh, oh no, because Scorpion's not got it yet. Sorry. Go on, Scorpion. There we go. Now can you capture Bagu? Not capture Bagu at this time. Uh, goodbye. Done that. Great. Now can you capture that one? Yay! There we go. Cheers, Scorpion. That was good. Why is there a corpse just laying here? I guess they were being carried there. Okay, so the shuttle has departed. 
quest has been completed. Yay! And oh, Galga's Baroness ceremony. Wow. Um. So we've got to upgrade our throne room. It looks like the room needs to be more impressive. It needs to be all fine floored. We need a harpsichord. What's this? That's a harp. Um. Hang on. Uh, where's Galga? I've got to look at her requirements here. Uh, I don't know, that doesn't... In the quest area. The map is clear of enemies of the Bestower's faction. Huh. Oh. Okay. Fair enough, okay. I don't I wonder who their enemies are. I might have to look at that. Uh so gotta go for fine flooring and a grand meditation throne. Okay, let's have a look. What's involved in making a grand meditation throne? We need gold. That's assuming we make it out of steel, of course. We could make it out of marble. Still gonna need gold. So we need we need some gold. Be grief, look at the size of the thing. Good grief, that's that's big. Okay. Well, and we need to find floor this, which is going to be trickier. All right. Well, let's um, let's get started on the flooring. So we're going to have to remove the floor that's already in there. That's step one. Uh, I see some trade caravans in our near future. So we're going to need gold aside from everything else. We'll maybe send a trade caravan off in the morning, actually. Uh, cheers, Dane. Uh, also, I'm going to need Parish. Can I draft you and head you down here? We need you to treat this guy once Dane gets to. Why is Dane taking so long? He's stoned on smoke leaf. Really? Like, I'm pretty sure we literally only just captured some, and already Dane has been smoking it. I don't know. Just. <sighs> Can't trust these colonists. Now the rate you're going now, Dane, this poor guy's gonna die before you get anywhere near the the, the, the prison cell. Oh, we are on slow time. Okay, Let's go a little bit faster. Oh, did they die? I guess they died. Oh well, never mind. Chicken's probably about to die as well. Yeah, one hour. Oh well. Sorry, we tried to save you, but Dane was stoned. <laughs> so no saving for you. Right, uh, I think we're going to want to do a caravan today. The time is right. Uh, although, let's wait until all these weapons have been hauled. So, in fact, let's get Dane, who's gone to bed, because he was up all night. Uh, what else can we do? Parish is flicking. She's coming to flick the switch. After you're done with that, I want you to prioritize hauling things. Uh, Scorpion, I'm going to get you to all things as well. Let's just get all this moved. And uh, Parish is already doing it. Scorpion's doing it. Galga, come, come, all things. If you wouldn't mind, just need to get it done. Oh, our animals can be de restricted. So hopefully they'll come and help with the hauling. Uh, beaver, bud, can you come and haul things? What's gone wrong there? Gogol's gone for a sad wander. What was the final straw? Darkness. <laughs> really, Gogol? Really? How's... Are you... Is he... don't know. I mean, his mood looks good to me. Well, fine. Uh, we're still hauling stuff over here. Parish, can I get you to come and haul these? Come on, guys, get everything moved. Let's 
Scorpion's going to sleep. Galga's hauling that. Uh, we've got fire. Uh. Ah. Huh. Well, okay. Ain't sure. Uh, Barracuda, you're drinking a beer. After you're done with that, could you come and haul this and haul that? There we go, that gets everything where it should be, and then we can get a caravan ready soon. The flooring is going well. Okay, almost having salt. So I think we'll do it tomorrow because it's getting late in the day. It's a bit late in the day for us to be sending Karen. So tomorrow morning, caravan heads off. We'll take that stuff to sell. We're going to get components and gold. That is the plan. Uh, also, we should probably toggle the power on for that because we've got corpses to burn. Uh, okay, this has been defloored, so uh, we're going to do fine marble tile. Like so. Well, fire. We've got a thunderstorm with no rain. Could it just rain and then that deals with this problem? This area is getting close to needing to be um, a good plant cut. So we'll queue that up as well. There we go, now it's raining. Good, good. How's our defoliator ship getting on? Concerning, but not an immediate risk. Find the rain, I'll put it out. There we go. See? Rain, rain, rain dealt with it. Well, our defenses work, although we are needing to rearm a lot of steel spike traps, and we are very much low on steel. So let's queue a little bit of mining. Uh, where's another convenient batch for us to mine? Ideally, not too far outside the base. Quite a bit of it here, actually. Queue all that for mining. There we go. <clears throat> all good. This needs repaired. That's going to be an issue. And this is out of wood. We do have wood cutting queued. Animal disease, plague. Thor has gotten sick with the plague. Oh no, poor Thor. Thor, buddy. The plague. Uh, where's Parish? Uh, I need you to go. Could you. Oh, Barracuda is already on it. Okay, cool. There are piles of corpses here. Okay, daytime. Let's get this. Let's get this caravan on the go. Uh, so we are going to form a caravan, which goes to here. We're going to send Galaga, because we have to, because she's the one who can trade. And who are we going to send with her? We will send with her. Should we send Raccoon, actually? Let's send Raccoon. There we go. And obviously we need to send... Um, our yaks for hauling. Uh, travel supplies, you're terrible at doing this automatically. Like, why are we taking potatoes with us? Hey, we got a little herbal medicine probably doesn't hurt, but two, well, take one of the excellent bait rolls though, because take a little bit more herbal medicine than that, just in case. Fine meals, how long does that give us? 4.7 days, but they rocked. 
But we should be able to forage, so let's just bring that down to three days worth. Right, what are we taking? What, what are we selling? Let's get rid of our kind of like bird skin, light leather, pig skin, camel hide. Keep the blue fur. Guinea pig fur. Definitely sell the thrumble fur, it's worth a fortune. Should we want to take these smoke leaf joints just so that, you know, our guys don't, like, smoke them and fail in their jobs because they're just... I just... Mm. Uh, right, what else are we going to send with them to? Do, 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 do. Uh, let's get rid of... Oh, Thrombohorns, yes. Take the Thrombohorns, because they're worth a fortune. Let's get rid of all of these weapons, except the biocoded ones, because nobody wants to buy biocoded weapons, but like all this junk can go. Sell all of that. Uh, this is all fine. We keep all of this. Get rid of our clothing that has reached the end of its service life. I don't know why these have been replaced. Oh well, I guess they can go. Yeah, all of this stuff, might as well. Uh, these are probably all good. Both need that. But Good, simple steel helmet, but that one's a bit dinged up. Formal shirt's a bit dinged up. Okay, okay, we know beer. We do have beer. Not much, but we do have, we do have some beer, so let's take the beer as well. Alright, that's a fair value of stuff we're sending. Should we even send some of our plain leather? We've got a lot of plain leather. Should we maybe send like 500 plain leather as well? Yeah, there we go. Send. Yeah, no, it's fine. We can graze a long way. There we go. So that will give us our caravan off. But as for now, this is probably a good point for us to put a break in. So as always, if you have enjoyed this episode, please do think about giving it a like. It really helps the channel out and is very much appreciated. And if you want to keep following along with this or maybe some of my other content, I do... Um, Crusader Kings 3 content, I do Warhammer 2 Total War content, and once in a blue moon I even do some World of Warships content, and there will probably be other content in the future. And you know, maybe give the channel a subscribe, and if you hit the bell icon, you do get a notification whenever I drop a video, because just hitting the note, I, I don't know. <laughs> and as always, I will see you next time.